If you're offboarding an employee, here's, here is your starting point for an IT checklist. So number one, most obvious is uh, remove all internal system access. So this is not just emails, but if you have an SSO setup or an identity provider or anything like that, take care of that first. Number two is a little bit trickier. It's close external employee accounts. And this can be tricky because it can involve shadow IT. Maybe they set up things that the company didn't know about. So dig in a little bit there. But the obvious ones are like cloud accounts or maybe social media admin access or things like that. Number three, you want to terminate VPN uh, access there or any other remote access methods you might have there also. Um, if they were a part of any shared accounts, change or revoke the passwords there. Um, and also remove them from any distributed list. So whether it's internally distributed or maybe to vendors, you don't want those internal employees or vendors reaching out to them from phone or email. So update that and get those uh, into the hands of the, the right people there too. Now, if they were admin or had uh, you know ownership of any part of the system, make sure you're swapping that also. And rather than just changing the employee's address you want to, or password, you want to do that first. Uh, you want to make sure you forward those to someone else uh, also, because maybe some other people, their email has been out there. You don't want to lose those potential business contacts that could help the business and uh, keep in touch a little bit better there. What you want to do also is not only recover a company equipment and assets, you want to dig in a little bit further. So if you've got laptops and cell phones, maybe it, you want to change the cell phone voicemail password or make sure that the cell phone is not forwarding to another uh, phone line or anything like that. Um, and also make sure you reclaim or cancel any employee licenses, update credit card payments. You don't want to pay for extra seats, for instance, or maybe they have their own card for the company that you want to take care of there also. Um, and then after all of that, you're suspending the accounts. You can worry about deletion after. Just put a little buffer time in there. Make sure nothing's lost out. And if this is one of the, the first times you've done offboarding, make sure you're checking in with legal and HR and adding anything to this list as well. So did I forget anything? Uh, let me know down in the comments down below. Uh, let me know if you have any questions also and have a good one.